Hi. Uh, currently on a train back in Switzerland. Uh, been on the road for a few weeks, so happy to be here. Looking forward to getting back up into the mountains, back up into the snow, back to my wife and kids. Um, but uh, yesterday I was in London and I partook in an event, a uh, thing called KPI, Key People of Influence. Young man wrote a book and is trying to show people how to do that, so we went to see if there were any ideas that uh, he could give us for doing that for Dr. Bowen and myself. And that, uh, when he started the day, he did his commercials, did his sponsors. He's somehow figured out how to get sponsored, but I think is a good idea. And uh, one of the spots, one of the things he talked about, peace one day. That's O N E one day. And uh, he said he meant at the beginning and said he's raising money for this uh, organization. And the last speaker on the program was this young man, uh, hippie-looking dude, long hair, t-shirt, jeans. Uh, so I could relate to him. I mean, I'm okay with the hippie dudes, obviously, uh, since I am one. <laughs> but he got up there and he talked about 10 minutes about what he has done in 12. And this guy has accomplished a lot. He's met with a lot of the world leaders and said, look, let's try this one thing. Let's try just one day of peace. Just, just one day. And see if we can accomplish that. And I got laughing at because he's, when he said the date... Uh, the date was September 21st, 2012, which is my son's birthday. And then, uh, my kids called me laughingly an old hippie, and they're okay with it. They just, I just thought that the one who laughed me for being an old hippie, it was on his birthday, and I thought that was rather significant somehow. But this man was full of energy. He uh, again presented. He there was a video and he presented, and, and then he said that his website is www.peaceoneday. And again, that's uh, those are all words, O-N-E in the middle, dot org. And I went to his website today, and you can sign up to be like a supporter. And uh, I'm going to like him on Facebook, uh, follow him on Twitter, and see if there are people out there who can support him energetically and maybe financially. I don't know what he's looking for. But uh, I think it would be cool, even one day of peace on the planet, I have held the thought that peace is possible, that war is stupid, it's outdated, it's running on the antiquated operating system based on kill or be killed, uh, which seems to be the entire planet running on it, well, most of the planet. And it's time for that antiquated operating system to stop. It's time for people to wake up, to step into a place of, maybe you might call it enlightenment, but of compassion, of love for their fellow man. and. Uh, Quit killing each other. Quit killing kids for oil or for profits or for land or for whatever. They're, all the reasons for war are stupid. Um, so uh, that's world no peace one day dot org. Uh, go fill out his little thing. Check him out. It's very interesting. Like him. Uh, let's get support support for this. A day without war on planet Earth. Wouldn't that be cool? www.micpeakperformance.com